Hey guys, it's Matt, and okay. <coughs> Today I'm gonna give you guys some tips about the um airport. I am going to Chicago on July 4th, 2015. I live in Arizona, so yeah. I used to live in Chicago, so yeah. That's why I'm going there. I'm there to see friends and family. I have to leave at 6 in the morning. Yeah, so let's just. Yeah, so I'm just going to tell you tips for the. Um, the. Airport! Oh my gosh, okay. Now let's get in, into. Into it. I don't know. Into it. Whatever. Okay. So, first suggestion okay. is to bring a phone with headphones. Headphones. Earbuds, headphones, whatever. Like, you really don't want to be stuck with the person sitting next to you unless, like, they're your family. But in the, but ever I'm going to, there's only three seats in a row, so there's four people in my family who are going. So I have to sit on, they're sitting over here, I'm sitting over there. If I'm okay. So, yeah, I really suggest bringing electronics in, headphones, unless you want to be stuck sitting to the person next to you, talking to them the whole ride. Next suggestion. I would suggest bringing some gum. I've already ate some of it. And if it's like wrapped up gum, Maybe offer the person next to you some. Somebody did that to me. Don't worry, it wasn't poisonous. So, yeah. But this kind of stuff that comes. So, that's so, like, it helps you. Actually, it doesn't give you very many headaches. If you get headaches on the airplane. Um, next thing, if you're going somewhere in the summer or it's just really sunny there, I suggest bringing sunglasses. So I'm gonna use my other sunglasses, but I can't find them right now. These are my mom's. So yeah, I just would suggest bringing sunglasses. Next thing I suggest is writing a list of what you are going to bring. I don't have anything on it. I'm doing this after the video. Next thing I suggest is bringing paper or and colored pencils or crayons or markers, whatever, just something to cover with. Next thing, wear comfortable clothes. So I'll show you what I'm wearing. I'm wearing these really comfortable pants. They have this right now. They are so comfy. With this loose tang top that's really loose on me. See that? And yeah. Another tip. When you are folding up your clothes, I don't suggest, like, folding them like that or whatever. I suggest rolling them. So you roll it this way. And you take it. 
in your wallet. So, once it's like that, you also roll it like that. Make it a bit more smaller. You can flatten it off or whatever. With those comfortable clothes, I suggest wearing socks. Very nice, soft, and comfy. Next, if you get bored, just like I said, they're calling you books. Bring some books. I have The Doll Graveyard, Just My Luck, and Judy Bloom, Here's to You, Rachel Robinson. Robinson. Also, maybe a magazine. Mine is... Which magazine is this? I don't exactly remember what magazine is. But, yeah. Magazine. And maybe a stuffed animal to help you sleep. Go to sleep. And wear an eye mask. I'm going to need one. So, yeah. And then I'm pretty sure I just have one more thing. And here it is. If you're going to work out or something that continues there, I suggest bringing this little pocket thing. Like, if you're going hiking and you want to listen to music, you could just pop it in there. Zip it up. And put it around your waist. Like I said, bring electronics if you have some. So, yeah, guys, I think that's about it. Um, I'll probably make a video on what, um, um, what I am going to pack. Like, I'll show you everything probably. So, yeah, if you're just wondering that. Yeah. So, I really hope you guys enjoyed this video. Don't forget. If you want, bring your stuffed animal to sleep with. This one smells like cotton candy. Or another one. Or another one. Probably only one. But, yeah, so I really hope you guys are enjoying this. Like, um, comment down below if you want, like, and comment if you want me to do a video on what to, on tips for an airport. And, yeah, bye.